Hi there, I'm meteorologist Glenn Glazer, and this is my YouTube channel, Met Dad at Home, which is short for Meteorologist Dad at Home. My friends and I have put this channel together. It's full of great family-friendly content. You'll find stuff for kids, you'll find stuff for adults, and make sure you subscribe so you know when we post something new. All right, enjoy today's video. Hey. Hey, Josh, how's it going, man? Good, Glenn. How are you doing? Good. Uh, for those of you watching this video, Josh and I have been friends a long time. Josh is a chef. He has owned restaurants. You're on some TV shows as well. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, Food Network Stars, season eight. Yeah. That was a few years ago. And then after that, we did. I did a little bit of uh, a, a follow-up to that show called Comeback Kitchen about three and a half years ago. I've seen that, I've seen that show. Yeah, I've seen both yeah. of those. It's, and then, it was a fun experience. And then you and I know each other because um, our kids went to school together, and then we yeah. just became friends, and we, we sort of mix kind of in the same circles, but we see each other like in weird places all the time. So yeah, and <laughs> even the studio. Yeah, a and you can yeah. segments on air. Of course, of course, and a great cooking Dying segment. To get back, hint, hint. <laughs> well, well, you just, well, look, you just normal. you just started this new venture, and then the yes. coronavirus hit. Um, tell tell us a Two little bit about. Two weeks after we. Two, two weeks after we get this catering company that's been around for 35 yeah. years, the virus, the coronavirus hits and we lose over 65 parties. So then we had to think fast and, and readjust and now we're, we're doing home delivery for freshly made meals three days a week. Fine. So everything, <laughs> I mean, you're sanitizing like crazy, you got. I mean, people are wearing gloves, hair nets, and, and certain foods that are like already ready to eat, um, masks on, our, on their faces. But everyone has also been prepped from, you know, the guidelines from the CDC. Mm -hmm. uh, we take a lot of that information. We pass it on to them saying, look, if anyone is feeling at all under the weather, stay home. We'll still take care of you because we're just trying to generate business so we, we don't have to let, let go of any staff. And so far, we've been lucky with that. We have we've been, keep, we've kept everyone employed. And once it once the food leaves your kitchen there, what kind of yep. what kind of precautions are you taking for the delivery service? Well, what what, we, what happens is um, everything's packed, airtight, sealed in um, bags, and um, that we are using our own vehicle, okay. our own safe own van, which has been cleaned uh, inside and out. I'm kind of maintaining that, and the driver has <clears throat> sanitize, sanitizer in the car. They're wearing their gloves when they're delivering each uh, boxed up or bagged up meal to every household. Wearing the gloves, and if okay. residents prefer, we could leave it at the front desk or at their front door and they step away so there doesn't have to be any close interaction i got you and the receipt's already there because they run the credit card over the phone when they call in to make the final purchase it's funny because you sent me your video uh that we we're going to yeah. show today and I, yeah. I thought it was so relevant because so many of my friends it's a video about seafood and so many of my friends right. went to the store they said i couldn't find anything but frozen seafood so i bought a ton of shrimp and your video today is about how to prepare shrimp shrimp cocktails yeah so I, to me i would have thought that would have gone first because it's a clean protein so if people want to eat healthy since they're not able to go to the gym or go out as often and it's such an easy thing to make that you just have to dump it in some water with some like orange orange slices and some lemon slices and some you could put some clove and some star anise and some peppercorns and just kind of like lightly simmer it until they're just turning white and now you cool them off and you've got a shrimp cocktail. Great. All right. Look at that. We're innovating yeah. on the spot. All right. Let's take a look at today's video. I'm sorry? Let's take a look at today's video. Okay. That sounds great. <laughs> sounds good. Sorry. <laughs> shrimp. Hi. So, Joanne, what are we making here? We're doing a, we're plating a shrimp cocktail. A shrimp cocktail. Very nice. So, we're kind of garnishing the, the bottom of the All kale. To the bottom, around the bottom. Nice. And that's to kind of give it some color and also kind of make sure that the shrimp doesn't slide around, right? Exactly. It makes it look a little prettier. Okay. Then we're going to do the, the cocktail sauce and the, sauce there's a the cocktail center. sauce. And what's in the cocktail sauce? Uh, ketchup, 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 lemon juice, and horseradish, right? Yes. Awesome. And we're going to just... Placing our shrimp. And we're kind of just... Overlapping them with the tails sticking out. They're sticking out so they can grab them. Nice. And this is also one of the items that people can order. 
on our weekly menu. And then we're really talking. And we have some lemon that we're gonna throw in there too. Mm -hmm. Lemon on the little edges. Nothing better yeah. than putting squeezed fresh lemon juice on top of like cold seafood. Nice. Start another nice. row with the, with yeah. the tails out. And that's uh, a nice way to actually plate something to go. <laughs> yes. <laughs> right? Yep. Perfect. But this would actually probably work if you were plating something at home. Right? Well, on definitely. A, on a, Anything. On a yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's nice. But obviously, we would put in a nicer ramekin for the sauce. Yeah, this is for our travel. You could even put menu. it on some, so some that's ice. Yummy. Yep, that's our yummiest right here. Yummy, yummy. Yep. Awesome. Thank you so much. It looks great. You're welcome. All right. I hope you enjoyed that video here on Met Dad at Home, Meteorologist Dad at Home. Uh, please subscribe so you know when we post new stuff all the time and have a great day.